so much to learn about It'll make you want to shout Blippi! Hey! It's me, Blippi! And look at where I'm at! I'm at a super center! But look at what it is! It's a delicious apple! I wonder how this apple got here. Every apple at the grocery store came from an apple field. First you gotta pick the perfect fruit. Like this one. This one looks really tasty. And after you pick it, you put it inside the bin with all the other apples. Let's try and find an apple together. Hmm, do you see an apple? Ah, oh, I see one. Yeah, look. Oh, yum. <laughs> it all starts by a worker hand picking every single apple. And then they dump their sack into the bins. And when the bin gets full, a tractor picks it up and takes it away. Now that the apples are all out of the fields and into the bins, and the bins are full, now we need to transport them to the trucks! Wow! Four giant bins full of apples. And one red tractor. Okay, the apples are now here at the semi truck. Now we gotta load up all the bins on top of the back of the semi-truck with a forklift. The bins are loaded on the back of the truck, so let's go! Off to the factory we go. We've arrived at the factory, so now we need to take a forklift and get every single bin off the back of the semi-truck. It is time to clean and package all of the apples! <laughs> Look! Green apples! Now we need to empty the bins of all of the apples so we can clean them and package them! The apples start their floating journey, while the bins get emptied out. Look, the bins are empty! Whoa! That's a lot of floating apples! Then they get taken out of the water and scrubby dub dub, <laughs> nice and clean! And clean some more! Look at all those bristles! Those apples look like they're having fun. <laughs> and then all the apples get sprayed with some water. Nice and clean. 
and then they go through giant fans. Once the apples are all dry, they get sorted. They get sorted by the ones that look really tasty to eat and ones <laughs> that don't look tasty to eat. And remember the not so tasty looking apples? <laughs> yeah, these are them. They get to go up some fun apple escalators, and then they get to go down some radical apple conveyor belts on their journey to make some tasty apple pie. But we're not done there yet. Every tasty looking apple gets a sticker. This is the sticker machine. And once every single apple has its very own sticker, they get put on what I like to call apple beds. <laughs> and then the next step is that those apple beds get put inside of cardboard boxes. And some get put inside plastic bags. Oh, looks like some of these boxes need their tops closed. Now that the apples are all clean and packaged up, we gotta store them in a giant refrigerator and wait for the trucks. <laughs> We're inside the giant refrigerator now. It is very cold in here. This is where all of the apples get stored. Wow, look at how many apples there are. That's a really tall storage building. Yippee, the semi-truck is backing up to the building so it can be loaded up with a bunch of fresh apples. Alright, forklifts, just a little bit more apples. Now that the semi truck is all full of apples, it's gonna deliver them to the grocery stores. Ooh, it was sure fun seeing how apples get to the grocery store with you. And remember, an apple a day keeps the doctor away. Hey! It's me, Mika! And today we're at Posh and Petite Playhouse in Woodland Hills, California. <laughs> Did you know this is a place where we can explore and be curious about different jobs? <laughs> I can't wait to try different jobs like an ice cream maker or a firefighter. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Which way should we go? Oh, check out this road. <laughs> Look, it's black with white stripes. Oh, black and white are opposite colors. 
Opposites mean they're completely different from one another. Kind of like, oh, night and day or hot and cold. <laughs> oh, check it out. Do you see that horse over there? Oh, let's drive our car over to him. Hello, horsey. I'm gonna name him Popsicle, cause I really love Popsicle. <laughs> Can you pretend to be a horse? <gasps> Nay! Whoa! Oh, he's got a lot of horsepower. Let's go! <laughs> Check it out, it's a marketplace. We can buy healthy fruits and vegetables here and make delicious meals. I know, let's be a grocer. <laughs> All right, see you later, Popsicle. First, we need our basket. <laughs> wow, check it out. If we wanna be a grocer, we have to get some items to put in our basket so we can ring it up. First, we'll need some alphabet soup. That's healthy and delicious. And how about some peas and carrots? And, ooh, mushrooms too. Check out all these healthy fruits and vegetables. Fruits and vegetables are good for your body because they help you grow strong. <laughs> I got it. Let's play a game. Fruit or vegetable? A carrot. It's orange and crunchy, and bunny rabbits love to eat them. Mmm, tasty. <laughs> Do you know if this is a fruit or a vegetable? Oh, that's right, a vegetable. Great job. All right, how about this? It's a cucumber. It's green and it has seeds. Fruits have seeds and vegetables don't. Fruit or vegetable? Oh yeah, that's a tricky one. It's a fruit, even though it seems like it's a vegetable. But great job. Hmm. Oh, yum. A strawberry. Strawberries are really, really sweet. Is a strawberry a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> awesome. A fruit. One fruit point, please. Hmm. Oh, look, a lemon. Lemons are one of my favorite colors, yellow, and they're really sour. Can you pretend to taste a sour lemon? <laughs> Whoa. Oh, sour is the opposite of sweet. Strawberries are sweet, but lemons are sour. Is this a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> right, a fruit, just like the sweet strawberry. Okay. Ooh, check it out, a piece of corn. Mmm, <gasps> that's delicious. Do you know if it's a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> right, a yummy vegetable. All right, let's go check out now. Welcome to Mika's Marketplace. Oh, I see you got corn. And you're in luck, because we have a special on corn. Just one cent. And a lemon. And our sweet strawberry. And a delicious carrot. And alphabet soup. Peas and carrots. Mmm, mushrooms. Wow, you got so many healthy options. <laughs> Being a grocer is so much fun. We even got to help a customer take home delicious vegetables to make yummy meals. <laughs> Let's go see what other jobs we can do. Yeehaw! Hey, we're at an ice cream shop. I know, let's pretend to be ice cream makers. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Let's go! Welcome to Mika's Magical Ice Cream Parlor. What's that? Fresh baked cookies? <laughs> Coming right up. Look at that, fresh out the oven. 
Whoa, they smell delicious. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve crispy cookies. Let's taste one. Mmm, that's delicious. Would you like a bite? <laughs> there you go. Mmm. <laughs> Do you know what this is? That's right, a purple popsicle, just like my horse's name. <laughs> Would you like a popsicle? There you are, one for you and one for me. Oh, that's really cold. Perfect for a hot day. Oh, those are opposites, hot and cold. When I'm cold, oh, it makes me shiver. But when I'm hot, oh, I could sure use a popsicle. <laughs> Would you like some ice cream today? Great, how many scoops? Five scoops? Okay, here we go. One chocolate scoop. Two, a vanilla scoop. Three, mint chocolate chip. <laughs> there you go, friend. Perfect. Four, a strawberry scoop. And five, a vanilla scoop on top. <laughs> wow, it's stacked up so high. Mm. <laughs> I love being an ice cream maker. I love scooping ice cream and tasting it too. Hey, I'm pretty good at it. <laughs> okay, let's see what other jobs we can do. <gasps> oh, don't forget Popsicle. Hello, Popsicle. Are you ready? Are you set? Go! Wow, check it out. We're in front of a fire station. A firefighter's job is to put out fires. Do you want to be a firefighter with me? <laughs> awesome, let's go. This is a cool fire station. Oh, look, a fire truck. It's red and really long too. <laughs> And look at these trucks. Zoom, zoom, pew. Let's go park. Zoom, zoom, zoom. All right, to the parking lot we go. <laughs> oh, and look at these trucks. They're really big. Oh, and these trucks are small. Big and small, those are opposites. How about this one? Big or small compared to this truck? Pretty small, right? <laughs> but what about compared to this one? Oh, now it's really big. <laughs> Do you hear that? It's a siren. Oh, we gotta get ready to go. Put out a fire. Hello? Yes, fire on one, two, three, fire road. Oh no! Let's go! Grab our hose! <gasps> Firefighter Mika is on the way! Grab my hose and save the day! Oh! Awesome! We just put out a fire! <laughs> that was so much fun! Thanks for helping me, you're very brave. Firefighters are really brave. <laughs> Let's go see what other jobs we can do. Whoa, look, an animal hospital. This is where veterinarians work. Veterinarians are doctors, but for animals. Would you like to be a veterinarian with me? Awesome, let's go. Oh, look at these doors. A small door for turtles and hamsters and gerbils too. And a medium door for bunny rabbits and ducks, quack quack, and ferrets and guinea pigs too. 
and a large door for cats and dogs. Large and small. Those are opposites. <laughs> cool. Oh, and look at this door for birdies. Oh, that's another opposite. High and low. Low and high. <laughs> Let's pretend to be birds flying to the vet's office. Tweet, 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 tweet. <laughs> oh, do you hear that? Paging Dr. Mika, you have a patient ready. Okay. Oh, and check it out. Here's our patient. Hello, puppy. How are you today? Little scratches, scratches. Did your family bring you here for a checkup? Oh, awesome. All right, let's get started, boy. We have a stethoscope. Stethoscopes are for hearing what's inside of your body, like your heart. <gasps> oh, may I check your heart too? <gasps> Great. Wow, that sounds nice and strong. Okay, let's check puppy's heart. This might be a little cold. <gasps> wow, that sounds so healthy and strong. You must be getting on your daily walks, huh? Don't forget to hydrate, okay? Doctor's orders. <laughs> oh, being a veterinarian is so much fun. I love helping animals and their families too. <laughs> now that I checked out the whole town, I'm gonna hit the road. Are you ready, Popsicle? <laughs> Let's go, giddy up! <laughs> Thank you so much for exploring different jobs with me today. <laughs> if I had to choose, I'd be a ice cream maker, grocer, animal doctor, firefighter. <laughs> all at once. <laughs> they were all so much fun, I can't just pick one. <laughs> but you know the best part? Exploring with you, friend. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? Oh, great! M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika! <laughs> okay, friends, see you later. Bye-bye! <laughs> oh, hey! It's me, Flippy. And today, we're here at the Special Spirit Organization and Danny's Farm <laughs> here in Los Angeles, California. And we get to meet some amazing animals. Yeah, I am so excited. This is gonna be so much fun. Come on. Whoa, look at it. <laughs> it's a horse. Hello. <laughs> yeah. And this horse has a name. Its name is Jasper. Hello, Jasper. <laughs> Jasper is so sweet. Look, Jasper is the colors white and brown. Whoa, Jasper is so nice and really soft to pet. <laughs> hey, and look at this. Jasper's eyes are different colors? Whoa, <laughs> that is a really big word called Heterochromia. Whoa! <laughs> That's a big word that basically means someone has two different color eyes. Yeah. This eye is the color brown. And this eye over here, whoa, it's the color blue. Whoa, <laughs> you have really pretty eyes, Jasper. Whoa! This horse is so big and so beautiful. Yeah, Christopher Pine, the color Brown. Whoa. And he's just eating some hay. Whoop. Hello. <laughs> yeah, just eating some hay. That's what horses eat. They eat lots of hay. <laughs> Whoa. And look. This big horse has a mane, just like Jasper. And a tail, just like Jasper. Whoa. And some really big feet. Look at it. Do you know what the name is for a horse's feet? <laughs> They're called hooves. Yeah, look at them. 
horses have hooves. <laughs> well, I've had so much fun learning about horses. Hey, I have an idea. How about you and I ride a horse in real life? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> If only we knew someone who could help us. Hello, I'm Blippi. I'm Keegan. <laughs> hi, Keegan. This is Apache. Oh, hi, Apache. Keegan, can I ride Apache? Yes, you can, Blippi. <laughs> yeah. I'm so excited to ride Apache. Okay, Apache. I'm gonna get on. Good boy, Apache. Good You're boy, early. Apache. I'm on Apache. We're gonna go on the sensory trail. Yeah. This trail uses all of your five senses. There's things to see, listen to, and touch. Ooh, I'm so excited. Okay, let's go. Walk on, Apache. <laughs> Apache's a really good listener. Well, look, we're coming up to the first thing in the sensory trail. Whoa. A stop sign, whoa! Okay, walk on. <laughs> hey look, there's some bells. Woo! <laughs> look at that! Look at that! They sound so pretty in the wind, and even prettier when you play with them. Woo! <laughs> okay, walk on. Let's see what else there is here. Walk on. Whoa! Over the bridge! <laughs> woo! And through the car wash! Whoa! <laughs> hey, look! We have Apache and Cherokee, and we're gonna walk them to give them a treat. Let's go! Whoa! You guys are so cute! Whoa, horses are amazing! Oh, hello, Keegan. Whoa. Okay, here you go. Now, time to give him some treats. <laughs> hello. You like a carrot? Whoa. Ooh, they love carrots. <laughs> and Apache's really hungry because I rode him. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, maybe Cherokee wants some too. Cherokee, would you like a carrot? You want a carrot? Oh no. Uh oh. Let me get that for you. It fell. <laughs> wow. Okay, here. I'll give you another carrot so that they both have the same amounts of carrots and apples. Mmm. <laughs> so tasty. <laughs> hey! Whoa! Look at where I am! <laughs> Inside the pen with all the animals. <laughs> There's so many different kinds. And look, it's Sunny. Hello, Sunny. <laughs> Sunny is a goat. <laughs> I love goats. They're so cool. Whoa. Hello. And Sunny is two colors. Look, the color golden brown and the color white. <laughs> yeah. Sunny is a really good goat. Yeah. <laughs> Goats are really cool because they're really great climbers. <laughs> Ooh, they can climb up all types of things and hop up on stools like this. Yeah, they can just climb on up. <laughs> no problem. Hey, do you know what a little goat is called? <laughs> yeah, a kid. <laughs> just like you. <laughs> or just like when I was little. A kid. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, but did you know? When goats are born, they walk right away. Yeah, they're born, and even though they're babies, they can walk. Whoa, that's so cool. <laughs> hey, 
Let's see if we can see some goats up close. Come on. Hello. Hi. Whoa. Look, it's sunny. Yeah. Sunny is a boy goat. But look, there's also a girl goat. Hello. <laughs> look at this. Sunny is a different color from this goat. This goat is kind of speckled, white and black. <laughs> Whoa, they're so sweet and really soft. <laughs> hey, did you know that goats, they like to burp? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> they're so cute and so fun to pet. Whoa, but look at this guy. Do you know what kind of animal this is? <laughs> yeah, that's right. This is a pig. <laughs> Can you make a pig noise like me? <laughs> or partly. <laughs> yeah, this pig? Well, actually, not this pig. This pig over here is named Hartley. And this is Hartley's mama. <laughs> Hello, mama. Ah, uh, <laughs> mama is really sweet. Oh, I forgot. Let's make those pig noises. <laughs> Can you make them with me? <laughs> so silly. Oh, pigs are so smart and really good smellers. Yeah, look. You see the pig's nose? Whoa, <laughs> that's a really big nose. It's bigger than my nose. <laughs> yeah, they're really, really good smellers so they can see their food. Whoa. And look, pigs, they're, they're kind of soft too, but not like a goat, because pigs don't have fur and they don't have hair. Yeah, pigs have bristles. <laughs> yeah, right here. Whoa, they're kind of prickly. And it's kind of like hair, but it's a little firmer and harder. Yeah, they're really cool to touch and to pet. <laughs> and they give scratches. Pitch, pitch. <laughs> Aw, well, it's so nice to see these pigs. Whoa, and look, Hartley came to say hi. <laughs> this pig is called Hartley because this little white heart. Well, it kind of looks like a heart. Right, right there. Yeah. Whoa, Sunny and Mama and Hartley. <laughs> These animals are so amazing. Hmm. Oh, and you see this other animal? <laughs> oh. Do you know what this animal is called? I'll give you a hint. This animal goes like this. Bah, bah, bah. <laughs> yeah, this animal? is a sheep. Ooh. <laughs> Hello, sheep. This sheep is really, really nice. <laughs> yeah. And sheep, they have wool on their back. Mm -hmm. Some types of sheep, yeah, they just shed kind of like a dog. Yeah, some sheep, they shed the wool on their back. But other kinds of sheep, like this sheep right here, they need to get a haircut. Yeah, they have shears, which are kind of like haircut scissors for sheep. <laughs> and they just give the sheep a little haircut on the back. But it's really important to not cut the hair on the back of the sheep so that they don't get too hot in the sun. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like wearing a hat, but <laughs> the hat is on your back. Whoa, <laughs> that's so silly. Whoa, hey. Do you know something else? Sheep are vegetarian. That's a really big word. Well, they're not vegetarian. <laughs> that would be as if they're a human, then they'd be a vegetarian. Sheeps are herbivores. Whoa, herbivores are what sheeps are, and vegetarians, that's what some people are. <laughs> yeah, and that means herbivores only like to eat plants. <laughs> yeah, plants, no meat. <laughs> Whoa! These sheep are so cool. Whoa! That was so amazing uh, learning about sheeps. 
and goats, and all kinds of animals here at Danny's Farm. <laughs> I had so much fun with you, and so much fun with you. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, will you spell my name with me? <laughs> okay, they're going to help spell it too. <laughs> B-L-I, P-P-I, Flippy, good job. Well, I'll see you real soon. I'm gonna get these guys <laughs> and gals some treats. Bye-bye. Hey, it's me, Flippy, and I was just dancing. <laughs> but it's really hot outside. I wish I could take a break. Well, no time for breaks when you're dancing. See that? Whoa, it's a popsicle cart, and I love popsicles. I think you and I should get a popsicle. Let's go. Hey. Hi, Blippi. How are you? What's your name? I'm Julia. Ooh. Would you like a handmade popsicle? Yeah, I love popsicles. What flavor do you have? This is cha-cha-cha. It's mango, pineapple, and chia seed. Ooh, that sounds so yummy. Mango, pineapple, and chia seeds. <laughs> that is so yummy! <laughs> yeah, glad you like it. Do you want to come see how they're made? Yeah! That would be so much fun. All let's right, go! Let's go! Welcome to my kitchen. Wow, look at this place. It's so cool! Thanks. Now, first thing, you need to gear up. <laughs> oh, check it out! This is an apron. Here we go. Wow. Okay, well, what do we have here? So, these are all the ingredients we use to make our popsicles. Ooh, it looks like a bunch of fruit and vegetables. Yep, you got it. We actually use a lot of superfoods in our popsicles. So, wow. you'll see kale and avocado and spinach and chia seeds. What's this? This is a coconut. Wow, that's cool. A coconut. Cool. Well, what flavor are we making? I thought we could make Popeye. Popeye? Yeah! All right. Guess why I call it Popeye? Um, I don't know. Why? I use spinach. Okay. So here you go. Hold the spinach. I was Ooh. making a batch earlier, so I thought we could just add to it. Okay, so here's some spinach, and what do you have? Strawberries. Strawberries. And to sweeten it, we use dates. Ooh, dates. <laughs> All right. Come on back. Oh, okay. So here's the batch I was working on earlier. Oh, look at it. All right. Oh, that looks yummy. <laughs> Go ahead, let's add it in. Okay, bye-bye spinach. <laughs> and then here are some strawberries. Ooh. And dates. Yum. Now, what might be different about your kitchen is we have some big equipment we use here. Really? <laughs> I'm excited. Whoa, look at that. <laughs> That thing is massive. What does that thing do? This is our immersion blender. Wow. So you put it in. Whoa. You hit the button. Whoa. 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 There you go. So that just blends it up into yes. a liquid? It sure does. Wow, that looks so yummy. Well, now what do we do? Now we're going to put it in our mold. Okay. And I'm going to get my trusty pitcher. Ooh. Wow. All right. So it's basically three ingredients all blended up to make one yummy tasting liquid. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna pour it in. Oh. And then you kinda just have to feed it through. Shake it around. Yeah. May I? Of course. Okay. Well, here's some more. Whoa! <laughs> we got some chunky ones in there. Yeah, that's okay. There's some more. Okay. And then next what we need to do is, we'll just put in our sticks. Ooh, yeah, like a popsicle stick. Have you ever eaten a popsicle and you hold on to the piece of wood? 
Yeah, that's what we just put in there. That's what makes them so handy. Okay. And now we put it into our extra special popsicle machine. Whoa, what does so, this thing do? It makes it super cold. It freezes the popsicle in 18 minutes. Wow, I'm so excited. I sure do love popsicles. Hey, check it out. Let's put it in. Whoa, so is that just really cold in there? Yes, it's actually made out of a special popsicle freezing liquid. Whoa, all I right. I can't tell you all my secrets. Huh. Well, maybe for later. Well, now what do we do? Well, usually when I wait for popsicles to freeze, I like to dance. Okay, let's go. Woohoo! I am so excited. All right, let's see what we have to work with. All right, you know what kind of fruit this is, right? Yeah, this is an apple. Okay, looks like we have some grapes. Yum! Ooh, what are these? Check these out. Yeah, these are lemons. Lemons are the color yellow. Wow, and then we have some greens over here. Whoa, spinach! Wow! Whoa! Hello! <laughs> it's like hair! Whoa, whoa! This is kale, and kale is really yummy! <laughs> and it doesn't like containers. <laughs> That's silly. Okay, let's put these back in here so then we can continue to see what type of fruits and vegetables we have. Like this! Whoa! This is so heavy! Whoa! Yeah! This is a watermelon, and watermelons are so big and yummy. Do you know what color is on the inside of the watermelon? Yeah! Red! And the outside is green. Okay, just a couple more. Bananas and Pineapple! Yum! Okay, so you can see we have this big bucket right here, and we need to put a lot of the ingredients right in here. Can't forget about the strawberries. We'll start with those. Here we go! Woohoo! <laughs> okay, that kale. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Let's put some in there. So good. Oh, apples. Okay, we could put the whole apple in there, but I think we should probably slice it. Have you ever had a slice of an apple? They're so yummy. Okay, here is our red apple slicer. And then put it right in the center, just like that. And then you push down. Whoa, look at that. That is awesome. Slice the apples, so then you pull them out, and then you can put them right in our big bucket. Wow. And you keep the core, whoop, <laughs> you keep the core, which is the center, 
out of it. Because there's a lot of seeds in there. Oh, speaking of seeds, watermelons have seeds. <laughs> okay, let's cut open the watermelon. Whoa. I'm gonna be very careful because I'm a grown up with this knife. Ready? Okay, here we go. Chop it in half, just like that. Flip it around. Wow, look at that. That looks so yummy. Our popsicles are gonna be so yummy. Okay, um, I have an idea. <laughs> Here we go! <laughs> All right, we have some bananas. Open those up. Here we go. Bye bye, banana. Woohoo! <laughs> and we'll do another banana. Yum! Here we go! <laughs> Yum! Look at it. Is that looking tasty or does that look tasty? <laughs> Whoa! And remember? We learned what fruit this is. Yeah, the coconut. All right, these are a little tricky to open, but it's worth the trouble. So let's take the coconut opener. Whoa, we did it! Look at that! Whoa! Whoa! Look at all that liquid. I just want to drink it all up. Oh, okay. We'll put that in the bucket for the popsicles. Whoa! Oh, yum. Okay. Use this little coconut device and pull out some of the coconut meat. Yeah, right in there. Ooh. Yummy! There we go. All right, perfect. Let's bring it right over here. Yum! All right. Oh, spinach right here. Woohoo! And then we have a bunch of grapes. We'll do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, 10, 11 grapes. All right, and then remember these, we used these earlier. These are dates. Here we go. Whoa! Okay, can't forget about the lemons. We have so many types of fruits and vegetables in here. Here we go. Wow. Okay, let's take these and give a little squeeze. Woohoo! <laughs> uh, have you ever tasted a lemon before? Okay, let's try some. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> That's sour. Okay, let's wash our hands. And then last but not least, we have a pineapple. We cut the pineapple just like that. And you see that yellow? That looks so yummy. So now we take this pineapple tool, put it right on top, and then give it a little twist. Wow, look at that. And then you pull it out. Whoa, check that out. And then take it off just like this. And that's gonna give it some nice. Hello! Hey! It's me, Flippy, and look at where I'm at. Whoa, today I'm at Young Chef's Academy in Covington, Washington. This place is so cool. Yeah, it's where young chefs, kids just like you, can come here and learn to cook some delicious treats. <laughs> Let's go! Hey, who are you? My name's Chef Riley. Oh, nice to meet you, Chef Riley. Hey, do you mind if we go explore the kitchen? Go for it. I'll see you in a sec. Okay, let's go. Wow, look at this kitchen. 
It is so bright and colorful. Whoa, come on. Okay, the very first thing that I need to do when you enter a kitchen is wash your hands. Okay, I'm gonna turn on hot water and then I'm gonna rinse them. Okay, get them nice and moist. And then we need some soap. Okay, and we need to scrub for 20 seconds. And one way to do this is to sing the ABCs. Ready? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. <laughs> okay, now we get to rinse off our hands. Let's get them nice and dry. Now, once our hands Dry, clean. Now, I can put on an apron. <laughs> yeah, an apron is used so then clothes not get dirty when you're cooking with some food. <laughs> All right, and can't forget my Young Chef's Academy chef's hat. <laughs> How do I look? <laughs> All right, check it out. This kitchen is so colorful. Do you see all these cabinets? Yeah, whoa. These, yeah, are the color green. Ooh, this over here, yeah. That cabinet is purple, pink, yellow, and blue. Whoa. I bet there's a lot of cool things in these cabinets. Whoa, look at this. Some yummy vegetables. Hey, do you know what kind of vegetable this is? Yeah, this is an orange pepper. <laughs> look at these. Yeah, some green beans. I sure do love vegetables. All right, <laughs> I'm so excited. This is going to be tasty. I am looking at the recipe of what we're going to be making today. Looks like we're going to be making crispy green beans. Whoa, those look tasty. And creamy ranch dip. Oh, this is going to be so yummy and healthy. I love vegetables and I love ranch dip. I wonder if we're going to be able to dip the green beans into the ranch dip. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so it seems like we need a lot of tools and a lot of ingredients. So, uh, let's get to it. All right, let's see what's in here that we need. Okay, looks like we need some measuring cups. Oh, a small one. A medium-sized one. Another medium-sized one. And a big one. Put those right back here. Perfect. Then we need whoa, a juicer. This is where you can put a lemon or an orange or a lime, squeeze it on top, and then all the juice comes out the bottom. Okay, we'll set that down right there. Alrighty, let's see what's in here. Hmm. Oh, we definitely need some measuring spoons. Whoa! Yeah, same thing, just like the measuring cups. The measuring spoons have four different sizes. From small, to medium, to medium, to large. <laughs> okay, put them right, about right in there. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, uh, let's see, how about, uh, oh. Wow, a measuring cup. This is what you put liquids, and you could do solids, but this is primarily for liquids. And this is what you measure to see how much you have. Okay, put that down right there. Oh, let's see, is there anything in here? Hmm, there's a lot of cool things in here. Whoa, look at this, it's a rolling pin. <laughs> oh, so cute. This is a small rolling pin. Whoa, 
And this is a big rolling pin. Whoa, they're used to flatten things out. I don't think we need those today, but they're pretty cool because you can use them for drums. Okay, enough playing. <laughs> let's get to cooking. All right, let's see. Um, Probably right in here. Oh, yeah. Two ingredients that we need. Breadcrumbs. And flour. Perfect. Okay, we'll shut this. All right. There we go. And uh, let's see. How about some cold ingredients? Wow. Look at this fridge. It's so organized. <laughs> okay, looks like we have some cream. Probably for the ranch dip. We'll set that down right there. Ooh, some cheese, Parmesan cheese. <laughs> okay, we'll put that down right there. And then we have some eggs. Yeah, check this out. Whoa, whoa. Okay, we'll put those down right there for later. <laughs> Probably shouldn't do that at home. And then we have some mayonnaise. Put that down right here. And some sour cream. Okay, put that down. And now, I think we're ready. Hmm. <sighs> looks like we have most of the ingredients and tools, but this looks really hard. Oh no, if only I had some help. Huh. Want some help with these? Oh, sure. I brought, hey. Hi, I brought the rest of our ingredients that we need. Oh, perfect. Okay, well, here's the recipe. What do we do first? First, we're going to want to preheat the oven to 425. Okay, uh, I know how to do that. Okay, preheat the oven to 425. Perfect. <laughs> Good job, Whoopi. Thank you. All right, first, we're going to want to do a tablespoon of flour into our bowl. Okay. We're gonna to wanna to make sure that we get a true tablespoon because that is not accurate. So we wanna scrape off the extra flour. Okay. Okay, can you do that? Sure. Okay, looks like we need some flour. Let's do a little scoop. And then, there we go. And perfect. Great job, Lippy. All you. right, next we're gonna to wanna to crack an egg. Okay. Let's see, so at Young Chefs Academy, we crack an egg using the table, not the edge of the counter, so that it doesn't get all over the floor in the mess. Okay. <laughs> you want to crack hard oh, and use your thumbs to break open the egg, just like that. Perfect. You'll want to put the shell in a separate bowl. Okay. Here we go. Let's use the table. There we go. Great job, Lippy. Thank Next, you. Next, we're going to want to wash our hands because we touched a raw egg. them off. It's really important to rinse off your hands and wash them completely after touching raw eggs or meat or anything like that. Now we're ready. Okay. All right. Next we're going to want to do a cup of panko. Okay. Use our cup there. Wow. So this looks about right. Yeah, so is panko just like breadcrumbs? It is, it's dried breadcrumbs. Okay, all right. Oh, I'll just use that. Okay, one big scoop. All right, in the same bowl? Yeah, oh, so sorry, in a different bowl. Oh, okay. Oh, thank you. Okay, here we go. Whee! Perfect. All right, next we're gonna wanna add the rest of our spices. Which is garlic salt and salt. Okay. So we're gonna wanna use a, a fourth of a teaspoon of garlic salt in our panko. Okay. Here 
There you go. This one? Mm-hmm. Okay. And then put it in the panko. Perfect. And then half of a teaspoon of salt. Okay. Thank you. Wow. Salt is so yummy. There we go. Can you use your whisk and whisk that up? Yeah. Oh, check it out. This is a whisk. Yeah. And How you do you do it? Whisk with your wrist. Okay. Whoa. This is a really good way to mix good it all up. Job. Yeah, you want to use it like that. All right, next we're going to want to put our egg into this mixing bowl. The clean mixing bowl that we have. Okay, here we go. Put the egg in this bowl. Whee! Oh. <laughs> We're gonna want to use a little bit of water. Just water like this in with the egg. Perfect. Thank you. All right. Put some water in with the egg. Perfect. Can you whisk that, whisk that egg up with the fork for me? With the fork. Okay. Forks are easier to whisk eggs than a whisk. Oh, so you want to whisk it just like that. Okay, so let's take the fork and let's whisk the egg. Whoa, did you see how the yolk broke up? Yeah, and now it's all mixed up. Perfect. That's perfect. We're going to grab a couple of handfuls of green beans right in here. Okay. All right. Perfect. And toss it in our flour. All right. Make sure you get them all nice and mixed up and coated in flour. Okay. Toss it. Wow. This Look is going to help the egg stick to the green bean. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> Look, they used to be green, but now they're green and white. <laughs> hey, remember how we washed our hands? Yeah, good thing we did because I'm touching food with my hands. You don't want to touch anything after you touch egg or raw meat. You want to make sure you wash your hands. Okay. All right, now we are going to touch the egg. We're going to put the green beans. We're going to use two different hands. We're going to have our dry hand and our wet hand. So we're not going to touch the egg with this hand. We're going to put our green beans in here and toss it around. Okay, take the fork out. Now, do a little tossing. There we go. Whoa, <laughs> I'm spilling. That's okay. Okay, wow. Look at it. <laughs> There's so much egg on these green beans. Okay. All right, great. Now you're gonna to wanna to put the green beans into the panko. Toss them around real quick. Okay. Wow. Oh, good. That looks job. fun. And once they're nice and evenly coated in panko, you wanna put them onto the tray. Okay. Whoa. These are gonna be so yummy. I know. I'm excited. Let's put them a little bit nicer so okay. that they're not so messy. Okay. All that right. way they'll cook really evenly when they're spread out on the there tray. There go. That makes sense. Oh, I see. Because if they're on top of each other, then the heat can't touch the whole green bean, huh? Exactly. You want to make sure that the whole thing is getting cooked. We're ready for the oven. Okay. Here we go. Here you go. Thank you. Perfect. Those will take about 10 to 12 minutes to cook. <laughs> Whoa, that was really fun making those green beans with you. Wasn't it? Yeah, let's make some ranch to dip them in. What ingredients do we need? We need mayonnaise, sour cream, buttermilk. Oh, wait, did you say buttermilk? Yeah. Oh, I said cream earlier. Okay, so we need buttermilk. Yeah, they're very similar, but buttermilk smells different and it's a little thicker. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, lemon juice, dill weed, parsley, chives, onion powder, garlic powder, salt, and black pepper. Okay, perfect. Looks like we have everything. I think we do. 
All right, next we're gonna wanna, so I have mine all mixed up. Can you put the mayo and the sour cream into your big bowl? Okay, here's the mayo. Then we have the sour cream. All right, there we go. Awesome, now we're gonna wanna do half a cup of buttermilk into okay. your bowl. All righty. Go. Perfect. All right, now we're gonna wanna get our fourth, one fourth teaspoon. Okay. Perfect, I'm ready. And we're gonna use that for our dill right here. Okay. Parsley and our chives. Okay. Dill, parsley, and chives. There we go. Good job, okay. <laughs> Next we're gonna want our half teaspoon. Okay. Bigger. <laughs> All right. All right, and we use that for our garlic powder okay. and our onion powder. All right. Okay, let's give it a little scoop. Okay, and then this one. Perfect. This is gonna be so yummy. All right. Perfect. Let's mix that up with our whisk. Don't right. forget, we whisk with our wrists. All right. Whoa, this smells so good. Once it's all mixed up, we're gonna cover it and place it in the fridge to cool. All right, we only have three more ingredients. Okay, what are they? Lemon juice, salt, and pepper. Okay. First, we want to juice our lemon. So okay. you have a lemon right up there. Perfect. We have it cut in half and we'll use our juicer here. We want to make sure we squeeze really tight, pushing down and twisting it around to get all of that juice out. Okay. Yes, I'll try it. Oh, there we go. Good job. Oh, yeah. So when you take it off, your lemon should look something like this. Yeah. It's almost empty. Perfect. <laughs> yeah. Okay. There's that for you. And then we'll want to pour our lemon juice into our ranch. Okay, here we go. Whee! <laughs> awesome. Mix that up. All right. Yum. Now we want to do one fourth teaspoon of salt. Right like this. Okay, hey, put some salt in here. There we go. Whee! <laughs> and a pinch of pepper. So we'll go about three twists. Okay. One, two, three. Perfect. Perfect. All right, let's mix that up. All right, mix, mix, mix. And remember to mix with your wrist. Oh, yep. Oh, wow, this is gonna be so yummy. <laughs> Delicious. Did you hear that? I did. Does that mean the green beans are done? It does, you wanna grab them? Sure. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. <laughs> oh, yum. Wow. Oh, those look delicious, Blizzy. Whoa, check them out. Oh my gosh. It looks like our green beans and zesty ranch are all ready. Oh, so good. Those look yummy. Check them out. Whoa, I am so excited. Thank you so much for teaching us how to make these. Of course, you did such a good job. Come back anytime. Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> See you later. See ya. Wow, I am so excited. <laughs> Here we go. Mmm. Mmm. Yum. That is delicious. <laughs> so silly. Yeah, you'd think because they're green, they're not good. <laughs> but hey, trust me, it's really fun to try new types of food. Yeah, like these yummy green beans that we made. 
Yeah. Hmm. 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 Yum. Even healthy foods can be really yummy. <laughs> Good job cooking. <laughs> oh, yee <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't that fun making those green beans and that ranch dipping sauce? Yum. It was so tasty. Hey, if you want to check out the exact recipe, you can go to Young Chef's Academy website and check out their blog. Woohoo! Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Flippy. Good job. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. It's me, Blippi. I just finished writing a lot of invitations for a party next week. <laughs> I'm so excited. And I'm excited because I'm gonna make a really yummy dinner. <laughs> Can you guess what I'm going to make for dinner? I'll give you a hint. Hmm. It has a lot of toppings and can be made really big so a lot of people can share it. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I'm going to have a pizza party! <laughs> and I know the perfect place that we can learn how to make pizza! Oleo Pizza! <laughs> Come on! This is going to be so much fun! I'll see you there! Hey! It's me, Plippy! And today we're here in our real life pizza kitchen! Yeah! So we're gonna learn how to make pizza! Oh, I'm so excited! But first things first, we gotta put on our gloves. Here we go. One. And we'll put on another one. <laughs> Here we go. Great, we got our gloves on and we're all ready to make some pizza. Oh, hey, hey uh, what's your name? Hey, my name is Michael. Uh, hi, Michael. Uh, can you teach us how to make some pizza today? Yes, no problem. I wanna teach how to make the pizza. Oh, okay. Okay, the first thing you need to take the spatula. Okay. Flour. Okay. And this is the dough, okay? Oh, yeah. Okay, you need to put a little bit of flour in the top. You take it out the dough. And you put again in the flour, okay? Okay. After that, you need to split a little bit of flour in the, in the front. You push a little bit, you take it out the, the air. Whoa. After okay. that, you need to shape a little bit. Push it. Nice. And you start shaping. Ooh, it's so stretchy and stringy. <laughs> yeah. Shape it, shape it, shape it. And when it's almost done, you need to put it again right here. Whoa. You're really good at making pizza, Michael. Yeah. After that, you need to put tomato sauce. <gasps> oh. This is the sauce. Whoa. Look at that. The spoon. <laughs> you just put the shape right here. Okay. Whoa. After that, you need to put the cheese. Okay, cheese. And this is a parmesan cheese. Parmesan cheese is so good, yeah. And this is a mozzarella cheese. Mmm, yummy. Oh. So and then fresh basil. Oh, fresh basil. Oh, you cut oh, it So yummy. And the small pieces. <laughs> Make it nice. Oh. And a. Uh, Cheddar heirloom tomatoes. Ooh, tomatoes! Mm. After that, you need to put like olive oil. Okay. <gasps> and that's the pizza ready for the oven. Oh, yeah! That pizza looks so yummy! <gasps> this pizza goes to the oven, okay? Yeah! <laughs> now, you wanna make pizza? yeah, can I make okay, a pizza no, too? Okay. Here take we go. The flour. Take the flour. Put the flour on the top. Whoa! Take so, it. Yeah. Here we go. Nice. We put in the flour. We'll put it in the flour. Yeah. Whoop. Play with the dough. <laughs> kind of sticky. Here we go. And we're gonna take it out again. Take it out. We should take it out the, the air. Yeah. Okay. We'll push all the air out and the bubbles out of the pizza dough. Whoa! Whoa! It's so stringy. Whoa! <laughs> so silly. Okay. Here we go. Keep pushing out Keep all pushing. those bubbles. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Keep doing it. Do it, do it Keep do pushing it. it out. A little bit, yeah. Mm. You can flip a little bit. Yeah. Nice. Here we go. Whoa, it's starting to look just like a pizza. Whoa, this is a lot harder than it looks. <laughs> here we go. 
Whoa. A little bit more. <laughs> you are really good at this. <laughs> Whoa. You can put tomato sauce inside? Yeah. You can put Whoa. tomato sauce. Look at this. This is really yummy tomato sauce. Whoa. <laughs> okay, now let's put the tomato sauce on the pizza. Here we go. Whoop. And then we're gonna mix it around. Okay. Parmesan cheese. Nice. And now we have our Parmesan cheese. So yummy. Ooh. Put a little on there. And the mozzarella cheese. And we got some mozzarella. Oh, whoa. This cheese is really cool because it's in all kinds of shapes. Do you know what kind of shape this mozzarella cheese is? <laughs> yeah, that's right. It's a triangle. Okay, so I'll put some of those little triangles and squares. Hmm, put some more squares. More squares. <laughs> Whoa, right, okay. After that, you need to put the basil a little bit. Um, some basil. Fresh basil. Fresh basil, yummy. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, that's a lot of basil. <laughs> yeah. uh, olive oil on the top. And a little bit of olive oil, here we go. Whoa. <laughs> so silly. And that's the margarita bean, so you can put the tomatoes too. Okay, we'll put a couple tomatoes that have been chopped in half that are also really yummy. We'll put those on top. And now the pizza is almost ready to go in the oven. The oven. <laughs> awesome. Well, really Michael, easy. thank you so much for teaching me how to make a pizza. No <laughs> yeah, and thank you for helping me make some yummy, yummy pizza. <laughs> Good job. Now, let's go put these pizzas into the oven. <laughs> Here we go. Whoa. <laughs> you need to you move a little bit because you sure you're not stuck in the pizza. Uh, you put it into the oven. Whoa. It's really hot in this oven. Whoa. <laughs> I can't wait for it to be all done. <laughs> let's go put the other pizza Let in. Let me put the other one. Yeah. It's the same thing. <laughs> This. Ooh. Make sure the toppings is good. Whoa! Whoa! Look at it! There's a big fire inside this pizza oven. It's really, really hot, and, and it helps to like cook the pizza. You wait like 30 seconds after that, you can flip the pizza, okay? <laughs> Whoa! Well, now all we have to do is wait for the pizza to get done. <laughs> so I'm gonna do a pizza dance. Here we go. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> okay, it looks like the pizza is almost ready. Let's see. Whoa. Whoa. The pizza almost done, almost done. is almost done. The pizza was really small, but because the dough has flour and yeast, when it gets really hot, the dough begins to rise and it becomes a delicious pizza. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Whoa! That was so much fun learning how to make pizza at Oleo Pizza. It was so delicious. Hey, did you know that pizza originally came from Italy? <laughs> yeah. And it makes me really want to learn how to speak Italian. So, I invited my good friend Francesca over. <laughs> I think that's her. Hello? Hi, Puppy. Hi, Francesca. <laughs> I'm so excited to learn Italian. We just learned how to make pizza. Do you think you could teach us some Italian? Si, sí, certo. Whoa, <laughs> that was Italian. <laughs> and I said, of course. Ooh, I'm so excited to learn. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. So first, maybe we should learn our numbers. Okay, let's count to five together. Okay, here we go. Zero. 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 <laughs> Uno. Uno. One. Due. Due. Two. Ooh. <laughs> Tre. Tre. Three. Cuatro. Cuatro. Ooh. <laughs> Which is four. Cinque. Cinque. Whoa. Five. Whoa. We did it. We counted to five. <laughs> okay. So we learned how to count to five in Italian. Maybe we can learn 
how to say our colors. <laughs> Rosso. Rosso. Red. Verde. Verde. Green. Ooh. <laughs> Giallo. Giallo. Yellow. Yellow. <laughs> and your two favorite colors. Orange and blue. Yes. Arancione. Arancione. Orange. Orange. And, <laughs> and blue. 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 <laughs> Whoa. That was so awesome. But I still feel a little bit hungry. Hmm. Maybe Francesca can teach us some food. Okay. So, cibo. Cibo. Food. Ooh. <laughs> Aqua. Aqua. Water. Water. <laughs> Pane. Pane. Bread. <laughs> Torta. Torta. Cake. Cake. I love cake. Especially birthday cake. Do you like cake too? <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Pizza. 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 <laughs> well, that one was pretty easy. Well, thanks so much for teaching us Italian, Francesca. You're welcome, Blippi. Hey, will you dance the pizza dance with us? Of course. <laughs> yeah, and you can dance along too. Let's go. <laughs> I'm so excited to do the pizza dance with you. Okay, stand up and dance along with us. <laughs> yeah. Step into my kitchen for a very tasty treat. With saucy sauce and cheesy cheese, these flavors can't be beat. Your mouth will start to water when you see what we can make. A little piece of Italy, the most delicious bake. Grab some dough, roll that dough, and toss it in the air. Then take a scoop of saucy sauce and spread it everywhere. Don't forget your toppings, extra cheese sure sounds nice. Open wide and take a bite of a warm, delicious slice. That was awesome! Woo! Great job! It was so much fun, Blippi. Thank you for having me here. Oh. It was so nice to have you. And thank you for dancing along and learning with us. Bye, Francesca! Bye, everyone! Bye, Blippi! That was so awesome! <laughs> we learned about so much today. How to make pizza, how to speak Italian. <laughs> it was great! Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with me? Okay, let's spell it together. B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. Good job. Well, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Today, we're at Ranch at the Pier. Mm -hmm. In Malibu, California. <laughs> yeah. Here, they have a lot of fruits and vegetables. Yeah, look at, oh, these look really yummy. Yeah, look, a really small watermelon. Yep, and here's a really small lemon. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Ooh, and some really spicy peppers. <laughs> Very hot. <laughs> oh. Wow, all of this produce is making me a little hungry. Yeah, me too. Oh, look. Popsicles! Yummy! Whoa! Mika! Hey! Whoa! Hey, Julia! Hi, Blippi. Nice to see you again. Nice to see you! Hi, I'm Mika. Hi, Mika. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. <laughs> so what's Mom and Pop Shop? So we sell all natural popsicles made with fresh fruits and vegetables. Ooh, that sounds good. They are. Do you want to try one? <laughs> yes, yeah. please! Oh, no! I'm so sorry we just ran out. They're so popular today. Oh. Hmm. Okay. What do we do now? Let me think. I got an idea. How about we go to the ranch and pick fresh fruits and vegetables and you guys make your own popsicle. That's a good idea. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like fun. <laughs> Great, I'll meet you up there. Okay. Let's go. Isn't it? It's remarkable. Did you know that they rescued 150 animals and 
It's environmentally friendly. Wow, 150 animals? That's a lot of animals. Yeah, it sure is. Yep. What does environmentally friendly mean? Well, nothing gets wasted at the ranch. So all of the vegetables that get sold at the pier, if there's any left over, they feed them to the animals, and then the animals nutrients the soil, and then the plants grow from the soil. Wow, cool. Very cool. Wait, so this ranch has fruits and vegetables? Hey, that's what we can use for the popsicles, right? Absolutely. So I have some baskets here where you could explore the ranch and get some fruits and vegetables okay. for your popsicles. Yeah. Oh, cool. <laughs> but do you know who else loves vegetables? Who? Oh. The horses. What? Horses? Oh. Yeah, go ahead Thank and you. feed some horses while you're here. We oh. can feed some horses? That's so fun. Let's do it. All right, yeah. see you later. See you later. Thanks, Julia. Excited to feed the animals. Me too. All Look right. At those beautiful horses. Wow. Hello, friend. How are you? My name's Flippy. Would you like an apple? Ooh, there a nice go. and healthy snack. All right. There you go. There's one behind you Ooh, too, there Flippy. You go. Whoa. <laughs> Look. Wow. Whoa. Do you like carrots? Oh. Yeah. There you go. I think that's a yes. <laughs> wow. They even have alpacas! Hey! Whoa, they're Whoa. so cute! Whoa. Oh, there you go. Aww. Are those carrots yummy? Whoa. Wow, they're such healthy eaters! Yeah. Ooh. There you go. Oh, you should Still probably chewing. chew and then swallow all your food before the next <laughs> bite. Yummy? Yeah. I think so. I guess so. <laughs> wow, that was so much fun feeding those animals. Yeah. <laughs> now I think we can find some ingredients to make popsicles. Oh, yeah. Fruits and vegetables. Oh, yeah. <gasps> Flippy, what? I have a great idea. What, Mika? What if we made popsicles for each other? <laughs> That's a great idea. Yeah, I can pick out ingredients that I know you'll like. <laughs> and I'll pick out ingredients that you will probably like. Oh, okay, All let's right. do it. See you soon. All right. See you later, horsey. <laughs> wow, look at how beautiful this ranch is. <laughs> Whoa, and look at this plant. This is rosemary. <sighs> and it smells so good. Well, and rosemary is actually edible, so that means you can eat it. But rosemary, I don't think would taste very good in a popsicle, so I'm not gonna pick it. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> Whoa, a lemon tree. Cool, come on. Whoa, look at these lemons. Yeah, these are just like the ones that Mika saw at the pier. Oh, maybe I should pick one. And just maybe I'll add it to the popsicle. Oh, all right, let's see. Give it a little tug. Whoa, look at it. It's so cute and small. <laughs> and these are Meyer lemons. Yeah, they have a little bit of sweetness to them. Okay, I'll put that one right there. And then, uh, let's see, how about this one? Right there. Oh, perfect. <laughs> yeah. Wow, I love this beautiful garden. Look at all of these plants and trees. Hmm, I wonder if I can find a fruit tree so I can pick some fruit for a popsicle for Blippi. Wait a second, here's one right here. This is a strawberry guava tree. There's different kinds of guava, but this is strawberry guava, which is really yummy. Take a look. See, it's round and kind of red. Ooh, it's so yummy. This will be the perfect ingredient for a popsicle for Blippi. Oh, I can't wait to find more fruit and vegetables. Let's go. Whoa, look at this garden. It's so amazing. Ooh, and do you see this net up here and on the sides? 
Yeah, that keeps all the critters and the birds from eating all this delicious food. Whoa, and look at this. Do you know what this is? This is spinach, and it's so good for you. Hey, maybe this would be really good in a popsicle. Yeah, spinach a lot of times is inside salads, yummy stuff like that, but popsicles also can have spinach in it. That is so cool. All right, that's probably enough. Let's see what else is around here. Whoa, check it out. Yeah, this is kale. Ooh, have you ever had a kale chip before? Yeah, you just take these leaves. Yeah, see that? That's a kale leaf. And then you put it in the oven. Whoa, and then it gets all crunchy. It's like a normal chip, but with kale. It's so healthy and so yummy. Hey, I bet this popsicle is gonna be the color green. Yeah, that's what we should shoot for. So then she'll have a nice, healthy, yummy popsicle. All right, one more leaf. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> wow, look at this fabulous garden. We are going to find some really good ingredients for Blippi's popsicle. Hey, these are beet plants. Beets are really cool because they're super healthy and they're yummy and they're really good for you. They're especially good for your heart. And they're a bright pinkish reddish color that will look really good in a popsicle. Now they're root vegetables, so they're underground. You have to hold on to the leaves and pull to get them out. Hey, look at that! A nice yummy beet for Blippi's popsicle. Hmm. There's so many different plants here, and really cool that you can eat all of them. Like this little carrot. Ha. Hmm. Oh, look! One of my favorite fruits of all time: strawberries. See if I can find one so I can show you. Ah, here we go. A nice, delicious red strawberry. Strawberries are a really popular flavor of popsicles and ice cream because they're really, really sweet. Mm, I should probably make sure that this is sweet enough for a popsicle. Mmm, it's perfect. Let's pick some for Blippi. <laughs> Ooh, here's a good one. Oh, this is a really good one. Oh, this will be so yummy in the popsicles. Let's go make some yummy treats. Hey, Julia, look at what I got. Yeah, um, tell me all about it. Well, I got some spinach. Perfect. Mm. <laughs> I have some kale. Yum. <laughs> and I got a lemon. Oh, what a cute lemon. <laughs> yeah, I really want to make Mika a green popsicle. That sounds amazing. There's not that many green popsicles out there, so I think you're onto something. Yeah. Here, let's get you an apron first. Oh, cool. Yeah. Check out my apron. Whoa, mom and pop shop. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> do you know any recipes we can do with a green popsicle? I do. I have one in mind. I don't think we need the lemon quite yet. Okay. But. I think we could use some green apples. Ooh, yum! Can I see? Yeah. Oh, check it out. Yeah, a green apple. Yeah, and do you know the other color of apples? Yeah, red. <laughs> cool. Awesome. And some green grapes. Whoa, green grapes. So yummy. <laughs> All right. And to add a little bit more sweetness, mm -hmm. I'm going to say a ripe banana. Ooh, a ripe banana. But wait a second. It's brown. Yeah, that means it's super sweet. And oh. that's what you want in a popsicle. Oh, cool. So if your banana has a little bit of brown on it, that's okay. It's just gonna be more sweet and yummy. <laughs> yep. All I right. think it's awesome that you wanna do vegetables in your popsicle. <laughs> Thanks. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab the blender. Okay. And then we could just put all the fruits and vegetables in there, just throw them all in. It's all a right. very powerful blender. <laughs> cool. Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh. Okay, that's nice apple. And then I'm gonna add some liquid. So anytime you use a blender, you need some liquid. Okay. Or else it's not gonna blend properly. Okay. All right, and what kind of liquid is that? I have some organic apple juice here. Ooh, yum! <laughs> All 
All right. right. So excited. I wonder if these are actually going to be green. <laughs> All right. And it's going to be pretty loud. So are you ready? All right. I'm All right. ready. Three, two, one. Done? It's done. Wow, it does look green. <laughs> All right. I think it's gonna love it. Yeah. Oh, do you smell that? Mmm. Mm. It smells so sweet. Yep. All right. Hey. And now we're gonna put the mixture in this pitcher so it's easier to pour in the molds. Okay. Wow. Check it out. Oh, yummy. <laughs> All right. And here are our molds. Oh, the molds. Yeah. I remember these molds. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yep, that's what we use in our kitchen when we have our big machine. Yeah. But today we're just making some at home pops. So we're using oh. our nifty molds for at home. Oh, cool. At home pops. Here we go. Hey, do you want to count how many popsicles we can make with this with me? Mm -hmm. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow. That's a lot of popsicles. All right, and then we just pour it in there? Yep. Would you like to do it or sure. me? All right. I'll, I'll do five and you do five. How's okay. that sound? Okay. Can we get a little foamy? That's okay. Yeah. Now I will pour five as well. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Perfect. He's gonna be so excited to have such nutritious pops. Yeah. Okay, and that's the lid? That's the lid we put on it, and then we just put some sticks on it. Yeah, the sticks. Cool. All right, so every single one of these, you mm -hmm. put a stick in? Yep. Okay. And the great go. part is when you're done with your pop school, you could keep your sticks and maybe make a birdhouse or Whoa. any type of crafting. Yeah, or a marble machine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> cool. <laughs> All right. So is it ready? That's all ready. Take it to the freezer. All right. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Julia. Hi, Rika. Welcome yeah. to the kitchen. Oh, thank you so much. So, Ooh. What did you find? I have some really yummy ingredients for Blippi's Popsicle. Yeah. I picked some strawberries. Perfect. And I have some guava. Oh, how cute. <laughs> and I have beets. Beets. Yep, that's a very interesting ingredient. What do you think you're gonna make? Beets me. Good one. <laughs> I don't know. I just thought all of these ingredients would look really cool. Mm -hmm. They could be a bright red or pink popsicle in the end. Yeah, they're gonna look amazing. So beets are very interesting ingredient. So I think we're gonna have to make an original here. Okay. So first ever popsicle beet. Ooh, cool. So let's get your apron first. Okay, thank you. And let's just start cutting them open. Okay. I think what we're gonna need to do is use our juicer for this recipe. Oh, a juicer. So have you ever seen inside of a bee? Um, I think so. Yeah? Let's see. It's a root vegetable. Yeah, I love that color. Look at that. Go ahead and smell it. Check it out. It's really cool. Hmm, it smells kind of earthy, mm -hmm. but also kind of sweet. Yeah, it's mm. gonna juice real well, so. We're just gonna turn it on. And you can throw the fruit inside. Okay. You see some like blades spinning there in the middle. Yeah. The blades move on the middle and just kind of crush everything and, and there's a sieve so it keeps um, all of the fibers inside. Whoa, look! You can see it's pushing all of the juice out of the berries right into the pitcher. That's so cool. And let's see what happens when we add the beets. Whoa. Smells yummy. Thank you. Okay. There go the beets. Look at how dark it turns. Yeah. What a pretty color. Mm -hmm. It smells really good. I can smell it already. <laughs> it does. And last but not least, we have our guava. Guava. And we can just toss the whole thing in there. Wow. Okay. There it goes. Ooh, you hear the seeds. <laughs> Whoa. This is gonna be yummy. Yeah. Whoa, that's a lot of juice. Mm -hmm. Now it's time for the molds. All right, they're right here. Wow. So these are the molds we use at home. It's a lot of popsicles. Yeah. <laughs> Lippy's gonna love it. Oh, yeah. Okay, can I pour? Go yeah. ahead. Okay. Try it out. All right. Might get messy. 
That's all of the fun. Okay, now to the freezer. And once they're done freezing, you know what we could use? We use compostable packaging. What does that so mean? These bags are compostable. So here at the ranch, you know, everything's sustainable. We don't want to leave any trash behind. So these break down easily in the trash. That's awesome. Yeah. You are being so good to the earth. <laughs> we tried to. All right, I'm going to put these in the freezer. Thanks, Julia, for Goodbye. your help. All right. Whoa. Whoa! Yeah, wasn't that fun, Mika? Yeah, that was awesome! Yeah, I'm so excited to show you the popsicle I made for you. I'm excited to show you the popsicle I made for you. Oh, all right! Let's see! Here we go! Ooh, Flippy! Whoa! Whoa! Wow. Cool color! Yeah, I really like that green! Yeah, what's in yours? Well, I made a popsicle for you from Beast guava and strawberries. Ooh, yum. Yep. Well, I added spinach, Ooh. kale, apples, <laughs> grapes, what? and bananas. Wow, <laughs> that sounds yummy. Yeah, I bet you'll love it. Yep, let's yep. try it. All Here right. Here we go. Here you go. Thank you, Blippi. You're welcome. All right, let's see. Here we go. Mmm. <laughs> That's really yummy. Yum! Good mm. job, Mika! Yeah, you too! Wow. Thank you so much! Thank you so much! <laughs> wow! Wasn't that so much fun making popsicles with the mom and pop shop? Yeah! At Ranch at the Pier! Yeah! <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name! Yep! Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I! -I Blippi! <laughs> Will you spell my name with us? Cool. <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. All right, see you soon. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye, Julia. See you, Julia. Bye, Blippi. Bye, Mika. Thanks for coming. <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi, and look at where we're at. Yeah, today we're at Pine Ridge Christmas Trees and Pumpkin Station in San Diego, California. <laughs> I love this time of year. Yeah, it's the fall time, and I love pumpkin patches. And today, you and I are gonna explore a pumpkin patch. Woohoo! <laughs> Woo! Who are you? How you doing? My name's Mike. Oh, nice to meet you, Mike. Nice to meet you. I'm Blippi. Wow, and look at what you have. This is a massive pumpkin. We grow a lot of these big pumpkins right here on the farm. Wow. It is so big, and I am so excited to explore your pumpkin patch and farm. Whoa. We're happy to have you today. We got 26 acres to explore and learn all about pumpkins. Wow, I'm so excited. All right, see you later. <laughs> Come on. Whoa, hello. <laughs> Check it out. It's a scarecrow. Ooh. <laughs> and this scarecrow is wearing my two favorite colors. Yeah, blue and orange. Woo. Whoa. <laughs> Wow, scarecrows are so much fun. Yeah, you put them on the farm, so then birds, like crows, don't come up to the pumpkins and eat all the pumpkins. Oh, hello. <laughs> wow, this place is awesome. Whoa, look at all these pumpkins. Ooh, this one looks cool. Oh, and this one is so circular. Wow. <laughs> Whoa, a green pumpkin. Whoa. <gasps> Look over here. Come on. Wow. Looks like a photo station. Wow. So cute. Hey, why don't we have a photo shoot? Whoa. <laughs> yeah. Let's continue to explore. I'm a kitty. Oh, I love pumpkins. <laughs> wow, this is so much fun. I love pumpkins. And look at all these rows of pumpkins. Whoa, hey, check it out. This wheelbarrow will help us carry these pumpkins. Whoa, all right. I think I found a really great pumpkin. Wow, look at it. Whoa, it's so heavy. 
Wow. Yeah, I could probably put this pumpkin on my front porch. Whoa. <laughs> you can also carve them, put silly faces in them, and make a jack-o'-lantern. Whoa. That sounds like so much fun. Woo. And have you ever eaten pumpkin seeds? Yeah, you roast them and they're so tasty. Oh, I am so excited. Okay, let me put this in the wheelbarrow. All right, and take it home. Woohoo! <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, check it out. The sign says Hayride. Yeah, I think it's time for a Hayride. Let's go. Whoa, check it out. Yeah, look at that wagon. That's where we're gonna sit for the hayride. But look up here, a tractor is pulling the wagon. Oh look, it's Mike. Hey Blippi, how you doing? Hey Mike, really good. I've had a lot of fun at your farm. That's awesome. You <laughs> learned to explore a lot of different things? Yeah, it's been really fun. <laughs> ready to go for a hayride? Yeah, I'd love to, let's go. <laughs> wow. All right, let's take the stairs and take a seat. All right. Whoa! Okay, I'm ready. <laughs> Whoa! This is gonna be so much fun. So excited to see what we find. <laughs> you ready to go? Yep! Look at all those pumpkins that are growing. Whoa, check it out. Wow, look at all those sunflowers. Wow, they're so tall and yellow. Ooh, and circular. Huh, maybe that's why they're called sunflowers. They look like the sun. Whoa, hey sunflowers. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Look at all these sunflowers. Wow, they're so pretty. They're so tall, they're yellow. Wow! Oh, and look at this one. Yeah, this doesn't look like a sunflower. Yeah, it's not big and yellow and circular, but this is a baby sunflower. And it's just trying to open up. And look at this. Whoa! After a while, the yellow petals will become open and enjoy the sun. And then, after it grows to be an adult sunflower, it becomes really big. Look at this one right here. Whoa, it is so big. Wow. And do you see how this sunflower has no sunflower seeds? Yeah, because this is a decorative sunflower. Yeah, they're so pretty. But some sunflowers have sunflower seeds, and you can eat them, and they're healthy. Yeah. And did you see all these bees around here? Yeah, the bees are very important because the bees cross-pollinate from the pumpkins to the sunflowers. So cool. <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Have you ever been curious about how a pumpkin grows? Hey, let me tell you. This sign says how a pumpkin grows. All right, it first starts as a seed and then the seed gets planted in the soil. You put a lot of sun and a lot of water on it. And then it grows into a green vine. Wow! And after the green vine grows a little bit, a yellow flower appears. Yeah, and then bees fly all around it, lands on it and goes around, and then it gets pollinated. And check it out. Yeah, a green pumpkin appears. Yeah, they start out to be really small. Then they grow big and big, and then, as time goes on, the pumpkins turn from green to orange. They can also be other colors, like white, red, and things like that. But you probably know pumpkins as orange. Wow! That's how a pumpkin grows from a seed to a big orange pumpkin. Yeah! Whoa! Check it out! We got an awesome pumpkin! Wow, it's so circular! This is going to be such a great pumpkin for us. <laughs> Woo yeah! Corn maze entrance. <gasps> Corn maze? Do you know what a maze is? Yeah! It's where you start at one location, 
you end at the other, but there's a lot of ways that you don't want to go because there's only one correct way. And this corn maze is made out of corn. Come on, let's go. Wow. Okay, now this is the entrance. Whoa, look at it. Yeah, whoa. <laughs> it looks like we go down here. All right, come on. Wow, these corn stalks are really tall. Whoa, yeah, they block from us going that way or that way. Yeah, there's only one way to go right here. So let's keep coming. Looks like there's a corner right here. Okay, looks like we're gonna go this way. Oh, look, <laughs> another straightaway, come on. Whoa, another corner. All right. <laughs> this corn maze is amazing. <laughs> Ooh, and check it out. Yeah. Oh, here's a piece of corn. Yeah, right here. Oh, hello. Yeah. And this kind of corn is called maize corn. Whoa. Okay, let's keep going. Come on. Wait a second. Look. Looks like we could go this way. Whoa. Yeah, do you see down there? Huh. Or we could go this way. Huh. Which way should we go? Should we go this way? Or should we go this way? <laughs> Let's go this way. Uh oh. This is the wrong way. Let's go back that way. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Come on. Oh, this must be the right way. Yeah. Come on. Wow. This corn maze is so much fun. You get to make all of these decisions. You can go left. You can go right. Yeah. And then you get to figure out if you're correct or not. Okay. Uh oh. Look at this. We can go this way. Whoa, does this look like the right way? Or we could go this way. Whoa, huh, let's see here. Let's go this way, <laughs> come on. Whoa, all right, come on, <laughs> woohoo. Whoa, this is taking a while. I wonder if we're gonna get out of here. Okay, another corner. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, come on. Feels like we're going around and around in a circle, but I think we're going the right way. Well, I hope we're going the right way. Huh, have we been here before? Let's see, we went left, we went right, and we went left, and we went right, and right, and left, and right, and left, 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 right, right. I don't know, let's keep going. Wow, I love corn mazes there. Wait a second, here's another option, look. We can go this way, or we could go this way right here, or it even looks like we have another choice right here. Whoa. <sighs> or we have another choice right over here. Whoa. Okay, so we have three choices. Hmm. What should we do? Why don't we go on this one? The very end. Yeah, the end for the end. Yeah, maybe that will have us complete the corn maze. Or We'll have a start all over again. Who knows? <gasps> Come on! Whoa! We did it! Oh, yeah! We did it! We made it to the end of the corn maze. That was so much fun. Here you go, go. Here you go. <laughs> Whoa! Check it out! Yeah! Here's a bunch of goats. Oh, are you hungry? Yeah, there you go. Wow, these goats are so cute. 
Oh, here you go. Looks like we have some big adult goats right here. Oh, you want some? Wow, and do you see these youngsters? Yeah, they're actually called kids. Whoa, ooh, it looks like they're so hungry. Yeah, a young goat is called a kid. Wow, and look, they're eating all this hay. Yeah, it's actually alfalfa. Yum, <laughs> yum for goats. Whoa, look at them. Whoa, it's a hay shower. Here you go. Oh, okay, you, you just want a bunch. <laughs> wow, whoa, okay, I'll set that down right here for all of you. Wow, they feel so soft. Oh, let me get that hay alfalfa off of you. Oh, here you go. Whoa, look at them. They are so cute. Wow, and actually all of them have a name on their name tag. Hey, what's your name? Look at this one. Oh, where'd you go? <laughs> Oh, hey, look at you. What's your name? Can I see your name? Ooh, this one's name is Ellie Mae. Wow, what a cute name. Oh, and look at her eyes. Wow, do you see her pupils? Wow. Yeah, her pupils are the shape of a rectangle. Wow, that was really cool. Whoa, hey, goat. <laughs> Wow, let me see if I can pick one up. They actually, these ones love when I pick them up. Yeah, oh, here you go. Oh, oh, I'll get you some more food later. Oh, yeah, oh, here you go. Oh, look how cute it is. Yeah, and he's just eating some hay. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. Oh, oh goat. Whoa, check it out. <laughs> Look at her goatee. Whoa, it's so cute. <laughs> there you go. You want some alfalfa? Wow, there you go. Whoa, look at it. You comb it? It's so straight. <laughs> wow, and it's so soft. Feels just like my hair. Wow. <laughs> See you later. Here you go. Whoa. <laughs> what a fun day. Yeah. We learned so much together today. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I, -I, Flippy. Good job. All right, happy pumpkins. <laughs> See ya. Oh, hey, it's me, Blippy, And this is Sheila. Hey, Sheila. <laughs> She's a farm dog. Whoa, and look at what I have. This is my lunch. I have a tasty apple, ooh, some strawberries, bananas, a sandwich with tomatoes on it, ooh, and even farm fresh eggs. Wow, have you ever wondered how this food gets to your plate? <laughs> yeah, I have too. So today, we are at Laughing Goat Flower Farm in Enumclaw, Washington. This is gonna be so much fun! Ooh, Sheila, look at these plants. Whoa, these are strawberries and blueberries. Mm -hmm. Have you ever had a strawberry or a blueberry? Yeah, so tasty! Ooh, and look at these. Hmm, pretty interesting looking. <laughs> this plant, yeah, this is another fruit or a vegetable. Yeah, this one's a vegetable. And this vegetable is called garlic. I love garlic. It makes my food taste so good. So garlic is actually a bulb right down there but it's not ready to be harvested yet. But up here, you can harvest the tops and it's also tasty. I'll show you how to do that. So I'm gonna take these really sharp scissors, so I'm gonna be very careful. And I'm gonna snip it right there. This is what it looks like. Whoa! One great thing about this farm is that all the food and the flowers 
are organically grown. <laughs> this is gonna be so tasty. All right, I think that's good enough. Let's count them. All right, we have one, two, and three. Wow, three pieces of garlic top. Yum! <laughs> Ooh, these are called snap peas. Mmm, mmm. And they're so yummy. Mmm, I think you and I should plant some snap peas. Okay, so to plant some plants, some plants you need a shovel where you dig a hole in a bed of soil, just like this, and put a seed right in the hole, fill up the hole, put some water on it, and then, after a lot of sun, and some more water, and a lot of love, it'll grow into a tasty plant. <laughs> all right, but for snap peas, all you have to do is put one of these plants in a box <laughs> right on top of the soil and push it down to right about there. Perfect! And then you take another one and push it down. <laughs> Let's do a few more together. Great! This is really fun! Look at them! See? Let's count them. One, two, three, four. All right, four minus one <laughs> is three. <laughs> oh, all right. Let's put the rest of these down inside the soil. There we go. Okay, so we have a bunch of them right in a line right here. So let's move the rest of that and those. Let's take the water and let's give them some water. Wow. All right. Then in a while, these are gonna grow into really big plants. And then they'll grow these on them. And then you can eat them like this. Wait a second. I think there's some big ones over there. Come on! <laughs> All right, so those snap peas that we just planted in seed form after two months are gonna grow to look like this. Look! <laughs> See, the plant has nodes and then those nodes grow the snap peas off of them. Ooh, pull it off. And look, you have a lot of snap peas off this one plant. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Have you ever tried a snap pea? <laughs> Maybe you should, they're really good. I sure do love tractors, huh, Sheila? <laughs> okay, all right, time for some more food. Come check this out. Ooh, these are strawberry bushes. And look down here. These are strawberries, really red strawberries. Let me pull it off. Yum! Mmm, mmm. Wow, that was tasty! Whoa, I love strawberry bushes. Ooh, and here's some blueberries. But they're not quite ripe yet. See these? Yeah, they'll be blue when they're nice and ripe. And then you can eat them. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> <sighs> 
Ooh! Now we're in the chicken coop. Hey, chickens! <laughs> and look, these are some tasty treats for the chickens. They love to eat these tasty treats, so then they lay lots of eggs. I love eggs for breakfast, of course. All right, here you go, chickens. <laughs> Wee, here you go. Oh, yum. They love these tasty treats. Just like how I love fruits and vegetables, these chickens love this stuff. I don't know what it is, though. Here you go. All right. All right. There you go. From there, you can spread the rest around. There you go. And now, I'll pick one up so I can pet it. chicken and they love to be pet on their head see hey chicken want to see the chicken oh so cute their neck oh so relaxed so cute hey chicken chicken hey chicken chicken see oh it's okay it's okay girl see the chickens live in this coop they love to eat food, just like me and you. So then, they can lay their eggs, so then you and I can eat them. They're so nice. <laughs> All right, here you go. Bye-bye. <laughs> Have a good day. <laughs> Time to pet another chicken. First, we gotta catch one. So now, in this room, this is where the chickens lay their eggs. Come here. Whoa, see them down there? Yeah, they're laying eggs. And if you look right here, there's a couple eggs ready for us to grab. Look. Right down there. One egg. Two eggs. Yum! <laughs> hey, pigs! <laughs> Another fun thing about this farm is they have farm pets too! Just like these goats! Whoa! And there's some pigs back here! Alright, hey! Down! <laughs> Alright, so let's give them some treats! Alright, let's see. Oops, sorry. Here's. Oh, whoopsies! Okay, let's set some of this stuff down. I'm gonna set that down. All right, who wants some banana? Oh, yum! All right, would you like some banana? Oh, there you go. Ooh, you know the banana peel part that you and I don't like? They love it! Check it out! You want it? Yum! Ooh. Would you like some banana? Yum! Enjoy! Woo! Would you like some banana? Okay, there you go. <laughs> okay. Hey, this one hasn't got any. Hey, would you like a treat? Hey! Oh! Hey, would you like a treat? Woo! <laughs> oh! Hey, down! Go down! There you go! Hey, pig! Hey, pig! There you go. Ooh. 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 Oh, all right. Would you like some banana? There you go. <laughs> all right. Ooh. There's some peel for you. Hey, down. Good down. Ooh. All right, here you go. You two can share. <laughs> Sharing's really good. Oh, here's some more treats over here. Oh, look! <laughs> Animal!
Oh, crackers. All right, who wants some crackers? Whee! <laughs> Here you go. Here you go. Here, see? It's an animal, but it's a cracker. Here you go. <laughs> hey, down. Put down. You see what I'm doing? I'm using this brush to give him a nice back scratch. There you go. <laughs> hey. Ooh, does that feel good? Yeah. Have you ever gotten a back massage or a back scratch? Yeah. This probably feels just like that. Right, pig? Whoa. The skin. Hey. Would you like to get brushed? Yeah, there you go. There you go. Yeah, does that feel good? It's kind of like a bath, but without water. And it doesn't clean you. It just feels really good. I like taking baths and showers. Nice and clean. And rubbing a brush on my skin. Here you go. Let's get you right there. Come check out this pig's hair. Whoa, it's really coarse and really thick. Wow. It's really thick. Oh, hello. Hey, pig. There you go. Oh, yeah, does that feel good? Oh, I bet. There you go. Yeah. See, I'm brushing this pig. This pig is really big. Whoa. Can I give you a hug? <laughs> Does that feel good? Yeah. It feels real good. You like your horns brushed, huh? Yeah. Here you go. You're a nice guy. Whoa. And do you see his eyes? Look. Look at his eyes. Come here. Do you see the black pupil? Yeah, that black part is called the pupil. And it's sideways. So then from there, the goat can see all around itself. Wow. <laughs> there you go, buddy. All right, have a good day. Bye-bye! Woo! What's in here? Wow, this is a growing room. <laughs> growing rooms are kind of like greenhouses. They keep a little bit more heat inside than outside. Right, Sheila? <laughs> All right, let's go explore. Ooh, look at what it is. It's a green hose. Whoa. <laughs> oh, hey, look at what's on the end of the hose. Oh, it's a watering spigot. <laughs> what does it do? Whoa, it sprays water. Let's water the plants. There you go. There you go. Yeah. Plants love to drink water, just like you and I do. All right. Wow. This is so much fun growing plants because I love to eat the food afterwards. <laughs> Speaking of food, look way down there. Ooh, look! <laughs> it's a plum tomato! Ooh, it looks so tasty! Shall we eat it? <laughs> Whoa, 
Yum. Hmm. Yum. Hmm. Ooh, another fun thing to do at Laughing Goat Flower Farm is to make a bouquet. Come on. Whoa, look in here. Some more plants. All right. So these plants you don't eat. Yeah. These plants you make a beautiful, beautiful bouquet with. All right. Here we go. Let's take our snips. All right, where to go? How about right oh, there? All right. Okay. Oh, that's real pretty. So, how you make a bouquet is you start with a base flower, like this. Well, actually, you start with a base plant, and then you add the beautiful, colorful flowers. But this plant right here, yeah, it's fuzzy. And it kind of looks th like the color white. Oh yeah, normally plants are the color green. <laughs> well, sometimes, really depends on the plant. But this one is pretty white looking. All right, let's cut some more, shall we? There we go. All right, perfect. And some more. Look at all of them! They're so beautiful! All right, what else do we need? We got a nice base. <gasps> we need some color! Let's go! Ooh, look at these colorful flowers! Yeah, they're the color yellow. These will look beautiful in the bouquet. All right. Whoa, so interesting looking. Okay, let's put that right there. <laughs> All right, one will do. All righty. Let's find some more flowers. Come on. <laughs> Whoa, another growing room. Ah, and more flowers. Perfect, just what we're after. All right, look at this one. Huh, all right, let's pull it up. Ooh, it's kinda white. Yeah, it also has a little bit of green and a little bit of yellow. Yeah, and it makes that color. All right, let's put it right there. Yep, perfect. Oh, look. Wow. Take out our scissors. Gotta be careful. Okay. Ooh, that one's the color white. Put that right there. Oh, whoa. Look at this one. Yeah, this color is the color pink. Wow, so beautiful. <sighs> it smells so fresh. <laughs> All right, and one more over here. Whoa. Whoa, look at that color. Whoa, it's a really deep, deep, dark purple. Whoa, that will look beautiful in the bouquet. Let's put it right there. All right, let's go find some more flowers. <sighs> Some more beautiful flowers for a bouquet. All right, let's take our scissors. Be 
very careful. This one looks perfect. Actually, this one looks perfect. See the color? It's the color light pink. All right. Whoa, <laughs> it fell. All right. <laughs> All right. Put my snippers back there. All right. Ah. So beautiful. All right. Put it right there. Whoa, look at it now. And it smells even more beautiful. <laughs> okay. Woo. Some more flowers. All right. This one looks ready. And this one is dark pink. Wow. All right. Let's take scissors, give it a snip, give it a smell, mm. ah, so fresh, <laughs> all right, here we go, let's put it right there, whoa, that's a big flower, whoa, it's so colorful, oh, I see some more over there, <laughs> beautiful flowers for our bouquet <laughs> all right let's cut some flowers together <laughs> all right Ooh, see this flower this flower is the color light blue wow beautiful all right let's put it in here all right perfect all right let's cut some more here we go. All right. Look, we have some more to place in here. Uh, how about one right there? How about one right here? <laughs> okay. <laughs> and we have two more. One, two. Let's put one. Right there, perfect. And let's put the last one right next to this big one. <laughs> All right, there we go. Perfect, so beautiful. Oh, look, more blue flowers. All right, let me snip some of these. Huh. These are the color blue as well. But remember the last flowers? They were light blue. But these flowers are dark blue. <laughs> Let's put them in the bouquet. All right. Here we go. About one right there. About one over here. About one. Let's see. Right there looks beautiful. And one right there. Whoa, what a beautiful bouquet. Let's go get some more flowers. Ooh, some more flowers. Ooh, interesting. See this flower? It's not fully blossomed yet. Huh, yeah. Oh, there's different stages of blossoming flowers. Look down here. See, this one hasn't even opened yet. It's still a baby. Ooh, you see this? It's trying to peek out. <laughs> it's like, hello, I see you. <laughs> But then it opens a little bit up, a little bit more. See? And then goes to a little bit more. Yeah. And then goes even more. Wow. And then after that goes, oh, I'm beautiful. I'm a flower. <laughs> and speaking of that, 
There's some down here. Let's go. Whoa. Look at these. Oh, let's cut one. Whoa. This is a new color. Do you see it? Yeah, this color is the color red. All right, let's add it to the bouquet. Let's put this one right in the very, very center. Whoa, look at that. It is so beautiful. I know what I'm gonna do with these flowers. I'm gonna surprise my mom. Shh, if you cut flowers, you can do the same. <laughs> Well, this is the end of this video. Bye bye Love you, Mom! Hey, hey, hey! It's me, Blippi! And today, we're at Tanaka Farms in Irvine, California! Tanaka Farms, yeah, is a farm where you get to pick your very own fruits and vegetables! Yeah! No grocery store today! Today, you and I are at the farm! Here we go! Ho ho ho! Check it out! It looks like there's a tractor and two wagons. Let's go. <laughs> Here at Tanaka Farms, you can ride the tractor on the Tanaka Farm Tractor Tour. <laughs> I'm so excited. Oh, hey, look. Hey, who hey, are you? I'm Farmer Kenny. Ooh, Farmer Kenny. Nice to meet you. I'm Blippi. What do you do here? Oh, I do a little bit of everything, drive the tractor around and take you on a tour. Whoa, can we take a tour? Sure, hop on on. <laughs> All right, let's go. I'm in a carrot field. All right, step on over. And you see all this green? That's the top of the carrot. Yeah, you don't eat that. The carrot is actually under the ground. That's why they call it a root vegetable. <laughs> okay, in order to pick a carrot, we actually need to find the carrots. So let's pull these back. Whoa, there's a lot right here. Yeah, see all this orange? Yeah, those are carrots. But they're pretty stuck under there. So let's take this giant pitchfork. Whoa, <laughs> looks like a small fork, but way bigger. And then let's loosen up the soil. Wow, and then we need to pick a carrot. Hey, here's one right here. Wow, check it out. We got a carrot. Whoa, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's cool. I love carrots, they're the color orange. I love putting them in my salads, my carrot cake, even some soup. Mm, they're so yummy. And they help your eyes be able to see at night. Whoa, pretty cool. <laughs> hey, and actually there's an animal that really loves to eat carrots. Can you think of what animal that is? Huh, let's go find it. Oh, cute bunny. <laughs> Look, it's a cute bunny. Wow, this bunny's name is Andy. Oh, <laughs> I wonder if Andy wants a carrot from earlier. Here you go, Andy. Huh, maybe Andy's not hungry. That's okay. Let's put Andy down. There you go. All right. Go, Andy. Whoa, I love bunnies. They are so soft. Hey, this is peanut butter, and the other one, its name is jelly. Oh, here's another one. Oh, 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 look at all those. Oh, hey, there you go. It's okay. Yeah. Wow, do you see this chicken? This is a modern game chicken. Yeah, and they still lay eggs, although they're really small. Yeah, look at them. Hey, you're so cute. Wow. <laughs> okay, let's put peanut butter down so then peanut butter can eat some of the mealworms. <laughs> okay, there you go. <laughs> oh, oh, and come over here. <laughs> I have something to show you. Wow, right over here. 
We have some eggs. Yeah, chickens lay eggs. Wow. We have one egg, two eggs, three eggs, and four eggs. These two are big eggs, and these two are small eggs. But these two weren't laid by the modern game chicken. These are still too big for those chickens. <laughs> okay, we'll put these eggs back right here, and let's go check out the chickens some more. <laughs> Chickens sure do love their snack. <laughs> Whoa! Hey! Wow! Do you see these? These are carrots. Yeah! They're the color orange. I love the color orange. It's one of my two favorite colors. <laughs> Whoa, and these are onions. Wow, that is a big onion. <laughs> and look at these. These are also onions, but these are called green onions. Yeah, they're both onions, but they look so different. <laughs> wow, this is romaine. I love romaine, it's so healthy. I like to put it in my salads. Wow, and these are beets. Whoa, these are golden beets, and these are just beets. <laughs> oh, look, check these out. These are cute. These are radishes. Do you see the color? It's kind of like a pinkish red. Yeah, I like that color. Wow, hey. And spinach. These are in a little case, a clear case. Yeah, spinach is green. A lot of these vegetables are the color green, it seems like. Well, see the radishes? Yeah, the part that you eat is the pinkish red color. But up here, this uses photosynthesis to grow the radishes. And this is the color green, but you don't need the top. <laughs> wow, kale. You should try some kale chips sometimes. Yeah, it's like normal chips, but healthier. <laughs> wow, are these drumsticks? <laughs> nope, these are sugar cane. Wow, <laughs> that is so sweet. <laughs> wow, Japanese eggplant. Wow, these are the color purple. It's a very dark purple. Wow, so cool and healthy. Oh, we got some green celery. We got some cauliflower. Mmm. <laughs> oh, can't forget about the summer squash. Yeah. Wow. And we also have some green bell peppers. Yeah, right next to the red bell peppers. Check it out. Yeah. Red, green. Red, green. <laughs> We'll put those back just right there. And last but not least, we got some corn on the cob. I love corn. <laughs> All right, Blippi, we're here. <gasps> yes. I am so excited. Wow, I wonder what type of food this is. Okay, let's see. All right. We could go down this row right okay, here. Okay, this one, all right. Whoa, what are these? Those are watermelons. Watermelons, wow, it looks like there's two different kinds. Yeah, there's these small round ones, those are uh, yellow watermelon. Okay. And those big oblong ones, those are red seeded watermelon. Wow, can we pick a couple? Yeah, let's find some to pick. Okay. So, uh, how about this yellow one right here, okay. right in the middle? This one? Yeah. Okay, how do you do it? Just go oh, in, comes hey, right off. It when it's ready, it comes right off. Wow, look at it. This watermelon is a circle or a sphere. <laughs> okay, all right. all right. Let me go, I'll go grab a red, okay. a red one. Whoa, that's a big watermelon. 
Wow, what shape is this? Looks like a sphere to me. Yeah, kind of like an oblong sphere. <laughs> or an oval. <laughs> All right, now, can we put them down right yeah. here? Okay, wow, these are so nice. Okay, all right. So, this is a normal watermelon, and we know what the color inside is, but we should just cut it open and check, Let's right? see what it looks like. Wow, yeah, green on the outside and reddish pink <laughs> red on the inside. Wow, and do you see the seeds? They're black seeds and white seeds. Whoa, okay. But since this watermelon looked a little different, what's so different about it? It just has a yellow inside flesh. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, because it's called a yellow watermelon. Can we cut it open? Yeah, let's cut it open and see. When they're nice and ready, they pop right open. Yeah. Whoa, I've never seen a watermelon like this before. Look, this is the color yellow. Wow. All right, let's compare them. Yellow, red. Yellow, red. Both are tasty. <laughs> wow. Let's see how it tastes. Mmm. Mmm, that's sweet. I love the taste of yellow watermelon. Mmm. <laughs> Hmm. What color is your favorite of watermelon? My favorite is yellow. Mm. Has a little bit different taste, but tastes really good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let me tell you, this tastes really good. Mm-hmm. You wanna try? <laughs> Ooh, strawberry. Mm. 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 Strawberries are so tasty. Let's go pick some more strawberries. Okay, do you see my container? This is called a clam shell container. Yeah, do you know what a clam is? Yeah, clam is a shellfish, and this kind of looks like it. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> okay, let's pick 20 strawberries. Whoa, that's a lot of strawberries. Okay, ready? One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, wow, eight, <laughs> nine, ten strawberries. Okay, we're halfway there. Eleven, twelve, minus one, eleven, <laughs> twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 16, 16, 17, almost there, 18, <laughs> 19, last one, 20. 20 strawberries in our clamshell container. Good job. <laughs> Woohoo! plants are these? <laughs> I've never seen these before. Wow, look at them, they're so tall. Kind of looks like corn stalks. But I know they're not corn stalks. Wow. <laughs> whoa, whoa. <laughs> that almost hit me. <laughs> We're stopping. All right, Blippi, we're here on Sugarcane Lane. Sugarcane Lane? Did you hear that? Oh, that's what these must be. Sugar canes. Whoa. Okay. All right, Farmer Kenny. All right. What do we do now? We're gonna cut some sugar cane down. Okay. Wow. Hey, these are sugar canes. Look at a nice stock. Whoa. Whoa, that's a sharp knife. <laughs> you just chopped it down. Wow, what's sugarcane used for? You could use it just to suck on. You could use it to press it out, make juice out of it. Ooh. Cook with it. Is that what they make sugar out of? Yeah. Whoa, sugarcane makes sugar. Wow. OK. 
Okay. Wow, look at that. So normally you just cut off the skin and chew on the inside. Wow. So you can chew on that right there? Yeah. Wow, anytime you use knife, you have to be very careful, right, grown-ups? And only grown-ups can use a knife. Oh, all right. That looks so yummy. Could chew on that little end? All right, let's try it. Mmm. Mmm. I love sugar cane. <laughs> Whoa, check this out. Whoa, this is a monstrous plant. And this is actually a flower. This is a giant flower. And this flower is called a sunflower. Wow, can you tell why it's called a sunflower? Yeah, because it looks like the sun. Whoa, wow. And sunflowers produce seeds. Yummy! Seeds are really healthy. <laughs> well, this has been so much fun learning about fruits, vegetables, and seeds with you at Tanaka Farms in Irvine, California. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B L I P P I. Blippi! Good job! All right! See you later. Bye bye. <laughs> hey, it's me, Flippy, and it's a really rainy day outside today. <laughs> but it's nice and dry in here. Whoa! And check it out. We're here at Adano's Gelati in London, England. <laughs> today we get to learn all about gelato. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> I think it's right over there. Let's go take a closer look. Come on. <laughs> Whoa, I think I see someone who can help us get some gelato. <laughs> oh, hi there, I'm Blippi, what's your name? My name is Christian, welcome to Odonos. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and do you work here? Well, I'm the owner. Whoa, that's amazing. Well, it's very nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you too. Well, I was hoping to get some gelato today and escape the rain outside. <laughs> Do you think I could try some? Yes, indeed. Oh, <laughs> great. Well, is that it over here? Yes, it is. Whoa, check it out. Real gelato. <laughs> yeah, do you see it? There are so many flavors. What flavor would you like to try? <laughs> ah, that, mm, that sounds really tasty. <laughs> Whoa, and look, yeah, there's hazelnut with real hazelnuts on it. <laughs> and pistachio with pistachios. Ooh, and, <gasps> Whoa, I think you know what flavor that is. Chocolate, yum! <laughs> well, all this gelato looks so yummy, but I also see some over here that's really brightly colored. It's yellow and red and orange. <laughs> is that gelato too? Well, that's sorbet, which is dairy-free gelato, and because it's dairy-free, the colors are much sharper. Whoa, <laughs> gelato and sorbet, <laughs> I wanna try it all. <laughs> Do you think we can taste some now? Of course. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Whoa, look at what it is. Gelato. <laughs> Christian, can I try this? Yes, you can. Whoa, look at it. Hmm, I wonder what flavor this will be. <gasps> vanilla. <laughs> but Christian, what's this on the vanilla gelato? This is the vanilla pod we use to make the gelato. Whoa. You know vanilla came from a pod. <laughs> sure is tasty. <laughs> Whoa, and I think I know what flavor this is. <laughs> Can you guess what flavor this gelato is? <laughs> yeah, cookies and cream, because of all the cookies. <laughs> well, is this a popular flavor? Very popular, we put a lot of cookies into it. <laughs> mm. Ooh, I really like this flavor. Yeah, I think I could eat it all day, but we have more gelato to try. <laughs> okay. Green gelato? Huh. Mmm, mmm, <laughs> this is tasty. Mm. Christian, what flavor is this? This is pistachio gelato. Oh, pistachio. Yeah, that's a kind of nut. 
has a shell, and when you take the shell off of it, it's green! <laughs> we use pistachios from Sicily, and they are so tasty because they grow on the side of the volcano in Sicily. Whoa, wait a minute. These pistachios grow on the side of a volcano? That's right. Hmm. Whoa, this is one of the best flavors yet. Yeah, it's kind of nutty. Mmm, and it's really sweet and creamy. Wow. <laughs> and to think that these pistachios were from the side of a volcano. <gasps> Whoa. <laughs> mm. That's pretty good. <laughs> mm. I think I could eat this all day. Well, I'm having a lot of fun trying it, but this is so tasty. I wonder, how is gelato made? Oh, Christian, do you think you could teach us how to make gelato? I think I can. Okay, <laughs> let's go. Follow me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Come on in, Blippi. Whoa, look at this place. <laughs> Where are we? We are in the gelato kitchen. Whoa, well, check it out. There are so many big machines to make all the gelato. <laughs> well, Christian, what's the first thing we need to do to make gelato? We need to change our outfit and become gelato scientists. Gelato scientists? Okay, here we go. Let's go. Whoa, check it out. We look like real gelato scientists. <laughs> well, Christian, how do we make gelato? Well, we need a gelato chef. Oh, that's good. <laughs> oh, but wait, what kind of gelato should we make? Hmm, well, I really like the color orange and I love mangoes. <laughs> Can we make mango gelato? Of course we can. Okay, <laughs> great. Well, we should probably meet the chef, right? Yep, okay. let's call him. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Hi, I'm Blippi, what's your name? My name is Andrea. Andrea, it's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Can you teach us how to make gelato? Of course. <laughs> okay, well, what's the first step? The first step is to pour ingredients. Whoa, and check it out. It looks like these are all the ingredients we need. So what are they? Milk first. Okay, <laughs> whoa, here we go. Pour in some milk. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh, looks like we're gonna make a lot of gelato today. <laughs> Whoa! And is this also milk? This is a cream. Whoa, check it out! Double cream! Whoa! <laughs> Can I try pouring this in? Of course. Okay, here we go. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> One and two. Hmm. Well, we added the milk and cream. And sugar. Ooh. Whoa. Check it out. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Ooh. <laughs> There's so much sugar. And, and some water. Whoa. And look, it looks like the sugar is so fine that it's kind of smoky. <laughs> some water. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> we need to mix them. Oh, oh well, so do we mix it here? Yes. With a blender. Oh, and Andrea, this is a blender? Yes. Oh, well, how does it work? You put it inside and then we start. Whoa! Can I try holding it? Yes, of course. Whoa, here we go. Whoa! Look at it! <laughs> We're mixing all the ingredients! Woo! Whoa, that's pretty fun. <laughs> Look at it go! How long do we need to mix this for? It's uh, is ready. Oh, it's good? Okay. <laughs> yeah, we can stop. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, you want to hit the red button stop when you're done mixing. Whoa, check it out. Whoa, Andrea and I made this amazing batch of gelato mix, but hmm, Andrea, it's not frozen. Hmm. It's not frozen. Hmm. What do we do next? We have to put it in the machine. Whoa, check it out. Whoa, here we go. <laughs> There's a big machine over here. And what's this supposed to do? This is a pasteurizer. Oh, whoa. So is that gonna heat up the milk? He eats the milk, yes. Oh, good, yeah. It'll make it nice and safe to eat. <laughs> okay, here we go. Maybe you can help me with this part. Yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> it's really heavy. <laughs> and Andrea, he's really strong. Woo! <laughs> Close the machine and we start. Whoa, <laughs> we started the machine. But, hmm, when will it be done? About 15 minutes. Okay, we'll be back in 15 minutes. Whoa, 
We did it! We waited 15 minutes and now it's ready to add the best ingredient. <laughs> but how do we get it out of the machine? Take it out from there. Okay, I think we're ready. Okay, <laughs> here it comes. Whoa! Whoa, and at this point, this is really hot. Yeah, they heat it up so that it's safe to eat. So you don't want to get your hands too close to it. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. And then we bring that back up here, right? Andrea, what do we do now? Can you help me with the mango? Yeah. <laughs> Check it out. We have mango. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. And it's orange. <laughs> okay. Time to add this to the mix. Look at it go. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> I cannot wait for this to be amazing gelato. It's gonna be so yummy, so fruity. <laughs> okay, and you wanna use the spatula to get all the, the big bits out. There we go. And <laughs> a little bit more. <laughs> we want this to be extra mango-y. Okay, <laughs> but mm, I think it needs to get mixed again. Is that right? Yes. Okay, <laughs> let's mix it again, woohoo! Whoa, look at it! The mix, it's changing colors! But what do we do next? We put again in the machine. Okay, whoa, yeah, but a different part of the machine this time, because it's gonna get really cold. <laughs> yeah, the first time we put it in the top so it could get hot and pasteurized. And now we're putting it in here to get frozen into yummy gelato. <laughs> and then we can eat it. Well, you're really good at this. You don't want to go too fast with pouring it because then it could make a mess. <laughs> what do we do now? Another 15 minutes. Another 15 minutes? Okay, well, we can wait. But this time, I want to do what I love to do while we wait. Time to dance. Oh, and we need Christian for this. Come on. <laughs> time for a gelato dance. Whoa, that was fun dancing. <laughs> Good job. But now it's time to get out the gelato. <laughs> Whoa, look at it. Whoa, it's so fluffy and creamy. <laughs> I can't wait to taste it. <laughs> and look, the mango is orange, but because we put it in the mixture, it looks kind of yellow now. Whoa. <laughs> oh, look at it. We did it. We made gelato. <laughs> Do you think I could taste some? Of course. Okay. <laughs> Whoa, and is that a spatula you're using? Yes. Whoa, yeah, you don't use an ice cream scoop for gelato. Yeah, you have a gelato spatula. <laughs> for me? Yeah. Oh, thank you. <laughs> we did it. Oh, hi, Christian. Hi. <laughs> Whoa, look at this. We made mango gelato. <laughs> Well, I wanted to say thank you so much for teaching me all about gelato. I had so much fun today. <laughs> thank you for coming. No, well, I'll see you soon. See you soon. Bye bye. Ciao, ciao, arrivederci. Woohoo! Ciao. <laughs> <laughs> we did it. We made mango gelato, <laughs> and now it's time to taste it. <laughs> Here we go. <gasps> oh. Mm. Oh, it tastes just like a mango. <laughs> it's so creamy and sweet and yummy. <laughs> that was delicious. <laughs> yeah, today was so much fun. We learned all about gelato from Christian, got to try so many flavors, and we learned how to make it. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with me? Okay, <laughs> ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. <laughs> well, I'll see you soon. I gotta finish off this gelato. <laughs> Here we go. Hey, look, we're on a farm. Look at all the animals. Whoa, ooh, ooh, look at this one. 
This is a cow. <laughs> and a horse. Ooh, and a pig. Oink, 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 oink. <laughs> ring, ring, ring. Okay, now that we're on a farm, let's see what other things we can find on the farm. Well, we saw animals already. Let's go. Ring, ring, ring. Ring, ring, ring. Whoa, bye bye. <laughs> we lost the wagon. We found some, we found a potato. We must be on a potato farm today. Potato. Ooh, and what are all these? A yellow hat. Okay, ooh, there we go. And, ooh, some eyeballs. <laughs> Gotta be able to see. Ooh, those are upside down. Okay, and, ooh, we have a red tongue. Oh, nope, that's the nose, actually but we do have a red tongue. Put that right there. Ooh, it's starting to look like a potato head. And green feet or shoes and pink ears. Uh, uh. Ah. <laughs> Ooh, are we missing something? Yeah, Ooh, look down here. Two white arms. Put one right there <laughs> and one right there. Whoa! Hello! <laughs> okay, you stay here, Mr. Potato Head. Let's go over here. Whoa! 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 Another Potato Head! Woo! <laughs> okay, ooh, we got a blue hat this time. Oh, I'm Optimus Prime! I don't know! Ooh! An arm with orange and blue goes on this side. Perfect. And another one. Ooh. <laughs> Whoa. Wah. Two eyes. One, two. Put them right there. Ooh, look at that orange nose. Put it right there. <laughs> and ooh, look at the smile. <laughs> okay, let's put that right here. And last but not least, some green shoes. Or er, blue shoes. <laughs> I said they were green, but these are blue. <laughs> okay, see what else we can find. Whoa, 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 whoa. Look, another potato head. Okay, we have some gray feet and a blue hat. Ooh, a police officer's hat, see? Wow. And whoa, a really big beard. Okay, and an orange nose again. Okay, there we go. Oh, what a cute nose. And Ooh, a couple arms. Let's put those up like this. Whoa! <laughs> it fell out. Did you see that? Okay, let's put it right there. Hello! Okay. And, ooh, we forgot the ears. Oh, the ears are falling out. Let's see? Okay. And then, the eyes. Okay. <laughs> it keeps falling out. There we go. All right, now we're all finished. Hello. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> okay, here we go. Woohoo! Look at what it is. Whoa, it's a tractor and a backhoe. <laughs> Whoa. It's a giant excavator! Whoa! It's so big! Come on! Scoop up the dirt! Whoa. And another potato head!
head. Okay, here it is. Now, a blue construction hat for the excavator. Put that on top and a nose and an ear and another ear. See? Ooh. <laughs> and an arm. Ah! And another white arm. Okay. Green shoes. Ooh. Put that right there. And two more things. We have a smile. A red smile. Eee! <laughs> Put that right there. And last but not least, couple eyes. Okay, there we go. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's keep on moving. Whoa, whoa, yes! Oh. Look at all of these potato heads. I need to sit down for this one. Okay. Ooh, look at this. This one even has eyes on it already. Okay. Ooh. Huh. Nice little, nice little princess hat. Hello. <laughs> Let's find some more princess stuff. And, uh, ooh. Nice high heel shoes. Perfect. Put it right there. And we already have the eyes, so let's find a nose. Um, where's a nose? Here's a nose, a pink nose. Okay, put it right there. And we need a beautiful smile. Where is a beautiful smile? Let's see here. Huh. Ooh, here's a beautiful smile. Ooh. <laughs> okay. There she is. Nice and pretty. And ooh, a really big ear. Oh, that's too big, actually. A normal size ear. There we go. And another normal size ear. <laughs> We're almost done. We just need cute arms. Ooh, here's one. This is just the hand. That will look funny. Let's put it right there. See? Short little hand. Here's another one. High five. Boop. <laughs> okay, and there we go. There is our last potato head. Whoa, she's so pretty. <laughs> well, this was so much fun finding potato heads on the farm. If you want to watch more of my videos, you know what to do. Just ask a grown-up really nicely to search for my name. Do you know my name? Yeah, it's Blippi. Let's spell it together. Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. All right. See you again.